Hey, any fish? Still the 22nd October 2017. And uh, yeah, a couple commenters. Uh, Alicia, Brenda, thanks for bringing this to my attention. This is absolutely mind blowing. This image, this Sports Illustrated image, it just went up today for the World Series. And, uh, you know, I can't even pull the image. They got it so I can't actually get the image. So I had to snip a copy of it out of there. But, uh, yeah, let's take a look at this. You got the guys on the bikes, Americana, cute, you know. That's a whole nother story we could talk about. But for right now, I'm sure most people are just looking at the numbers of the jerseys and so forth. And straight up, what I see here is represent of the uh, separation, the harvest, if you will. You got the dividing line right here, right? It's all nice over here. Nice trees, beautiful sunset. And it ain't so nice over here. Dark, stormy treacherous right you got these guys over here in their white jerseys you got these guys over here in their orange jerseys welcome to the world series orange right it's got to be orange you take their jersey numbers you got 22 and 10 32 there's your 23 right there you take these guys you add the 60 the 2 and the 7 are 9 69 there is your iron and miry clay. Okay? This is what's happening. And right up here, folks, you got Lucifer himself staring down his trophy. Okay? That's what it is. There's his eye. Staring down there with his right eye. See that? The side of his face right there. Is his ear back there. The side of his nose. That is Lucifer. It's just admiring his trophy, Earth, because it's about to, uh, things are about to change, let's say that. And at the bottom of this trophy, which is called the Commissioner's Cup, is a little representation of the world. That little dome in there, you see. It's got all the longitudes, latitudes on it. That's what our buddy here is looking at. Down the trophy to, his, to the world. And you got the separating, the 69, the 23. 23 are leaving soon. This is what I get out of this. Not only that, if you add them all together as they are, you get 119. If I didn't already say that. But that's, uh, that's quite something right there, huh? Good old Sports Illustrated. Lightning coming down from Lucifer. He's claiming his trophy. He's claiming his trophy, folks. And you're going to have to make a decision at some point. You know, I don't know what to tell you. This is too blatant. And I've been getting these left, right, and center. And I'm still convinced how it's going to begin very soon. The, the calamity is going to begin with a... Uh, stock market thing because all our little pennants in here all our little pennants in our trophy well i search pennants and of course you have sports pennants but they originated through admiralty and were incorporated into the stock market your flags and your pennants so there i go back to the stock market again and there is you know a whole bunch of more stuff we could talk about about this image but man oh man phew Alicia, Brenda, this is amazing. This is, this is literally showing you basically the harvest. I, I don't know what to call it. Rapture, uh, the wheat and the tares. Man, that's all I'm seeing lately. And calamity, calamity's coming. So, I hope this, uh, you know, brings some understanding to people about where they live and what they're dealing with. And that you really do need to look into your heart and ask yourself, you know, is this world of darkness really where I belong? Because I'm sure your heart and your gut and your soul don't think so. We just muddle along here and do the best we can. But it's 
it's becoming next to impossible to not find darkness, wickedness, and evil around every corner. That doesn't mean we don't still take joy in every day that we get to serve on this earth. Because that's what it is. There's no fear attached to this when you know Christ. There just isn't. You understand and you know, you know what's coming. And yes, it is bitter in the belly. But you know what? It has to happen. And you need to choose who you're going to serve. You can't serve two masters. Okay? Peace and grace to you all. Many fish. Finally, my brethren, be strong in the Lord and in the power of his might. Put on the whole armor of God, that ye may be able to stand against the wiles of the devil. For we wrestle not against flesh and blood, but against principalities, against powers, against the rulers of the darkness of this world, against spiritual wickedness in high places. Wherefore, take unto you the whole armor of God, 